Hey, it's Jeff here from I'll Be In The Garage. Got a little project today. I am gonna transfer all my volatile stuff. In other words, high explosive nitroglycerin. Well, I don't have any of that, but all my oil-based paint, solvents, all that stuff into this gigantic steel cabinet that I just bought on Kijiji off a guy. This is a real beauty. And what I just did in the last hour is I added put casters on the bottom so the whole thing can roll around and what I'm going to do is remove the guys old stickers the old breast stickers and the, uh, the pinup girls in here well I don't mind pinup girls so much but I don't like these motorcycle modern ones I'd rather be 1940s pinups so that's what I'm doing I'm gonna take all the stickers off I'm gonna sand this sucker down and I might even paint it bright red with the words volatile on it so I'll see you soon. Okay, well it's day two here, and as you can see I scraped all the stickers off, which wasn't so easy. It looks like the monolith from 2001 A Space Odyssey, doesn't it? Oh. Anyways, what I'm going to do is give it a quick sanding with my orbital sander just to uh, get any remaining residue off there, and then we'll think about priming this thing. Okay, we got the cabinet outside here. It's all cleaned off. I'm just, I washed it down. I'm just letting it dry out. And then I've decided what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the, the most rusty areas. I'm going to give them a coat of this stuff. This is red oxide primer. And afterwards, I'm just going to roll on red trim clad. I'm not going to try to spray it. I don't think it's worth it. I think the roller texture will look just fine. So first things first, let's uh, spray the rustiest areas with this primer here. All right, that's butt ugly. Ooh, it closed by itself. <clears throat> so I just hit the roughest, uh, most rusty spots with the rust primer. So. Ugly as sin, but it's gonna look good in a minute when I uh, uh, let it dry and then paint it. Now the only issue I had is I didn't, I didn't have enough paint to get the inside side walls here. That's no big deal. I'll just, I used to black spray paint in there. I don't want to go buy another can of red, but I think it looks fabulous and it's just awesome. So I can't wait to put it in the garage and get my stuff in there. All right, the cabinet's finished. Looks great. Very nice bright red. Looks great here in my workshop. And what I've already done is I put my uh, my posters on the side here for the old car. All my tech specs and everything are here on a poster. This is the lubrication chart. That's the wiring diagram. Over here I've got some classic kind of posters I printed up that look kind of cool. Yes, that's Joan Blondell in an ad for spark plugs. And inside, Instead of the motorcycle pinup girls, haha, <laughs> we got classic pinup girls. That's cooler. There's Toby Wing. And as you can see, all my stuff, all my solvents, anything volatile is kept in here now. Very nicely organized. Even my auto, my oil and my gasoline and so on. And. There's Toby hunting in her underwear for some reason. Anyways, yeah, I love it. Great cabinet. All done, on to the next project.